Now, as an update, uh, what we've been doing is assembling raw materials and de designing uh, the nitty-gritty details of experiments, and the, the experiments have now begun, and we are in the uh, process of, uh, uh, of executing those experiments, and then we have, uh, next week, we will be uh, putting the results of those experiments into final finished products so that we can actually test the finished products on real people. This early stage of prototype, uh, we're working with Moton Marine Laboratories directly so that, um, that uh, we can um, uh, do proof of principle. That means, uh, can we create a, a oil-based vehicle for the antibiotic that we develop and a water-based? Because right now we don't know which, if the antibiotic from the sea is water-based or oil-based. Sus I suspect that it's oil-based partially because if not, an an a, a fish swimming in the sea would lose all its antibiotic chemistry. And uh, so to have it stay on the fish surface, it would have to be oil soluble. And we're going to prove that, and, and, uh, that hypothesis one way or the other. Take one drop. And I'll rub it in. You can see the color go away. Now you can see that the skin is um, it's totally, it's totally absorbed now and about uh, two minutes has gone by and uh, there's a slight layer of grease on there which is what I want because that gives you a layer of protection and, uh, uh, but I've gotten all of the um, omega-3 fats into the, um, into the skin now so um, uh, later on I'll do this in a controlled way where I'll measure the amount of time it takes for it to actually happen but I won't do that for a couple of days because I need to have the test in control to show the differences, but uh, this is very, very encouraging. Very, very encouraging. I'm very excited, actually, <laughs> you know, for a scientist. <laughs>